So this was my first time in Spain, and this was like actually my first time seeing a different type of school and seeing how they, uh, how their environment is. I got to experience so much stuff, especially in terms of food. They have dinner at like 9 p.m. and 10 p.m. and then lunch at 3 p.m. So I got to experience like a whole different type of, whole different type of environment, how they uh, do their culture. So their lunch is like huge, it's bigger than ours. They don't have lunch at school. They're able to go home and then they have like a 30 minute break in the morning and then they can go to the market or they can walk around their town. The food there was like absolutely amazing. I was able to try paella and all these sorts of different types of things. I'm super grateful that I've been a part of this trip and um, it definitely inspired me to see more of the world. I've traveled a little bit before. Uh, I was just super grateful for the family that um, took us in. It was kind of nice, you know, sitting around the table and, uh, you know, I could like tell like the family dynamic, just all them teasing each other and laughing. It was just like, it was really nice. Seeing apart from that, just like seeing what city life is like, because here in America, I don't live in a city. So I don't know how similar it would be to American city life or not, but it was really interesting to have everything close by, everyone walking to places. Yeah, an experience like this definitely um, inspires me to um, see as much as I can of this huge world we live in and it's so varying yet so similar in everywhere you go and there's so much to see and so many people to meet and so many cultures to learn about and share with and I think that's amazing. So this was my first time out of the continent but now out of the country so like it was different to see the world as like in a different viewpoint and like the, I really value the sense of love that the like parents showed to me like every single day they would always make sure that in the mornings that I was warm making sure that I had gloves and hats scarves coats and then like even when we were out with their friends she would always make sure that like when they were making jokes she would always make sure I understood like who was funny and like she would just like explain everything and I really just I really valued like even like the um the sit down at dinner when they would like talk to me and try to speak Spanish so I could understand what they're saying and like just trying to keep me like a part of the family and like show me love. So I've traveled before but I've never been to Spain and something I thought that was really amazing was the fact that we would go on day trips or take little trips with my family after school and we'd literally drive 30 minutes and we'd get to see a cathedral or a castle or a church that was as old as the 11th century, just right in their backyard. And I thought that's just something really special about European countries, especially Spain, because our country doesn't have that super rich deep history like that. They go and see these things on the daily basis, like something special that we, we don't get to see unless we take a nine hour flight, you know? And I really appreciate the family I stayed with for taking me in and treating me like one of their own. They really made sure that I had a great experience and they wanted me to make sure that I saw everything I possibly could see in the time that I was there. And definitely special thank you to the um, teachers that took us, Sunira Wallace and Sunira Dunbar, for um, you know, putting this whole thing together.